Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Ariel. Uh, more of the same stuff. We're just gonna have Indian food. But today we're actually going to go on a hike to some waterfall up here in Banff. So follow along. All right, we are leaving Wanda to go out to have dinner. And if it seems like all we do is eat, it's because that is what we do. What, what do we yeah. do when we're inside Wanda? I'm generally napping, we, watching we, videos. Walter is accounting stuff. Uh, we're doing postcards. I'm either editing videos. I knit a little bit. And then we, we seem to eat at least twice a day. And then we eat. Yeah. And then we go out to go eat. Why do we eat so much? Or why do we eat out so much? It's because I don't want to do dishes. When you think about it, your prep time, your cooking time, and your cleanup time, oh, and also your grocery time, that all takes time. And for us, it's easier to just go out and eat. They have a diverse ethnic restaurants. So tonight, we're gonna have Indian food. Isn't that a beautiful mountain? Gorgeous. Okay, we are here at downtown Banff again. I do like the way they do have public parking in a lot of the blocks here. We're able to find parking. And we missed our crossing. And God forbid, we jaywalk. Nope, we won't tell you what. We're having Indian food over there, downtown Vamp. This is an adorable little town. So we're gonna cross over here. Again, yes, all we do is actually eat. We like eating. I like eating. All right, here is where we're having dinner tonight. Authentic Indian cuisine, masala. All right, right next door to the Indian restaurant, there's a Filipino market. Isn't this fabulous? I found my people. <laughs> Market. Right next to the Indian restaurant. <laughs> Had to go back and get some essential Filipino items. Right outside our window. Magnificent mountain views. We're gonna have tandoori chicken, basmati rice, and we're going to try something new. Mahani. A smooth combination of lentils tempered with tomatoes. Well, who knows? Let me find I it. I thought again. you said you wanted this one. Here it is. Bindi dough piazza, tender okra, sauteed with onions, tomatoes, and garlic. Tandoori chicken, something okra, garlic naan, and balsami rice. Basmati. Basmati. We just had an excellent dinner, Indian, here in downtown Bam. We're kind of uh, we're just looking around right now, and I really don't want to walk. We're gonna head back to the car and back to Wanda and watch Captain Marvel. Walter's never seen it. Yeah. So back to Wanda. We're gonna hike back. To the parking lot. This is our hiking. We might do a hike tomorrow. I got a hike trail from the ranger station. Trail map. A trail map. So we'll see if there's a short hike that I can do. Probably late, right before lunch, maybe. We'll do that. Oh, and here's the Banff. Oh, look, it's called the Banff Asian Market. It's really Filipino. Mostly Filipino with Asian stuff. It's cold. I forgot my hat. It's back in Aries. And here we are waiting for signal light because God forbid that we jaywalk. We are trying to go to, what is it? Junction, Castle Junction. No, wait. No, Johnson. Johnston, Johnston Canyon. 
and there's a waterfall over there and it's a 1.3 kilometer getting there in 1.3 so it's 2.6 kilometer hike we're actually gonna hike today and according to this map which is really nicely spread out they got green it's just like skiing they got green they got blue they got triple black diamonds traffic's moving well, that traffic's not moving okay so explain to them what johnston canyon is johnston canyon ink pots Travel in the depths of the canyon on wide trails and narrow bridges with railings that lead to the lower falls and to the spectacular 30 meter upper high falls. For a unique perspective, continue 265 meters further to the viewpoint at the top of the upper falls and beyond the falls, a trail continues up over the forested ridge to a meadow where the water bubbles from deep below the earth's surface into shallow pools called ink pots. Johnston Canyon area is popular and parking is limited. Take public transit. Okay, we're doing the Johnson Canyon track. And yes, Walter and I are wearing the same exact shirt. It's in miles, not in kilometers. So we're only doing lower falls. Which so it's a mile hike. He's not all about the food. We do hikes. Yes, we're hiking. We're hiking. Okay, we are here, and we're doing that. Okay, the trail is now hugging the cliff. And it's a... Uh, it drops. And there's nothing the underneath this bridge except water and rock. And it's at an incline. Yeah. It's at an incline. I have to rest when we get up there. Oh my god, I'm out of breath. Okay, we haven't seen any litter along the trail, which is good. Very impressive, very happy about that. Walter does have a suggestion. We could see so much more of the canyon, the mountain, the waterfall, everything, if they got rid of these pine trees. Absolutely. Yeah. Leave the ones on the other side where nobody looks. But on the side where we're looking down, just get rid of them all. Okay, that was my suggestion. There's a waterfall right here that you can barely see because of all these trees. Most of them dead. And who cares about the trees on that side? Nobody even looks. Yeah, yeah. see, so we keep the trees on this side, but on that side of the trail, chop them all down. That's yep. what Walter wants. And I'll bet if you did a survey, I'd win. Okay, we're gonna continue on. We had a nice restful rest. At these benches. Okay, the trail continues on hanging over the cliff. Oh dear lord, mud! Ah! That's what I'm talking about. No trees. Yeah. Ditch this one and we're all set. Yeah! Okay, we made it to Lola Falls. There it is. Very pretty. We're gonna go to the tavern. children. Okay, why do we hate children? Because the carbon footprint of each of those tiny little brats is not worth it. And a lot of them, they're useless. They don't get an education. They're not going to make anything of themselves. And no, not every kid is special. A lot of them become plain, ordinary. They make nothing of themselves. I think we're getting close to the end of our trail. <coughs> Oh dear lord, there's another hill. Mm -hmm. We're not hikers. There's been a lot of up and downs on this trail. See, there's another hill over here. Look well, at I'm that. I'm sure it was blue. Look at that. There's another hill. Wasn't this a blue trail? 
This was a green trail. It's a green trail, easy. the easiest possible. It's not an easy trail. Oh, it reminds me of skiing in, oh, in, and look in at Germany. This. Look, at, look at this. This is that's disgusting. This is absolutely disgusting. This is why dogs should be banned from all parks. We are having lunch, more food at Johnston Bistro. Uh, chicken wings, and Walter's having the hamburger and fries. And another spectacular view out the window. Mm -hmm. Okay, Walter thinks this is me. I don't know why. I, for one, think I'm more this. Okay, we just completed the trail. And on our way back to the parking lot, going back to the RV, we're going to do 100 postcards rest up and then take showers we're all sweaty right now from our hike and then go out to dinner okay our last night here in Banff and we are having dinner at Japanese restaurant Mickey okay because of the high amount of Asians that just came up came before us there's a table of like 20, 20 over there. So it's going to take us 30 minutes to get our, our meal. But in the meantime, look at this. This is so cute. How to make a paper crane. And they provide the paper. Okay, we are having shabu shabu. Okay, excellent shabu at Nikki's. Miki, Japanese restaurant. Excellent shabu. Excellent shabu. One of the best we've had. And regarding food in Canada and Alaska, if you eat out a lot at home, it's the same thing when you're on the road. You can eat out. There's not a shortage of restaurants. If you eat home a lot, then you're going to eat home a lot. It's whatever your dining habits are at your home. That's what it's going to be when you get on the road. And ours hasn't changed. We eat out 90% of the time. Well, maybe 95. So. Oh, and just for informational purposes, tipping in Canada is the same as in the US, 15 to 20% for good, excellent service. And if you don't get it, leave less. But, you know, we've had fantastic service on the road. They work hard for their money. You know, leave 15 to 20%. You're on vacation. Treat people well. Thank you. All right. Thank you for watching. Bye.